My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. This is really one of my favorites here right now. I absolutely love this truck, the color, the stance, the wheels with the red line tires, what really did it for me. Body off frame restored, 454, custom leather bucket seat interior, air conditioned. This is the bomb right here. 1967 Chevy C10 pickup. If you go to volocars.com, that's where you can read all the specs, study all the pictures and get the price. Not only on this one, but we do have a few hundred collector cars that are all for sale at volocars.com. If you enjoy watching the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. For right now, join me. Let's go for a spin in a 67 C10 truck. Normally, I start talking about the underside, but I mean, the, the truck itself is just gorgeous. We got to talk about this for a second. The stance, the wheels are bigger in back. They're taller and wider. I looked up these wheels. They're shot velocity forged aluminum wheels. They're $1,330 per wheel, plus the tires and installation. This guy's got almost seven grand in tires and wheels on this truck. So the body was off the frame. It's all new body bushings, and it was all rebuilt. The whole front end, steering, uh, suspension, all rebuilt. New shocks, new bushings. Uh, same thing in back. Uh, the shocks, the springs, the bushings have been replaced. You look up at the motor. It's got a chrome oil pan, a chrome uh, high-torque starter. It has the flywheel cover, a turbo 400 automatic with an external cooler. Um, brake systems all been redone, of course, as disc brakes in front. Um, custom dual exhaust system, Flowmaster mufflers, has a crossover pipe, uh, polyurethane bushings, and again, it's a lowered suspension. So they got lowering springs and probably spindles in front because it's dropped down a significant amount. So the body. Uh, well, we're coming around. This, this has got to be show chrome. This front bumper is like a mirror. Nice bumper guards here. And look at the fog lamps built right into the bumper. All this is new. The trim, the lenses, has some custom headlights in there. That's all new. Has a cowl induction hood. And the rest of the truck is smooth. Notice there's no, no marker lights, no emblems. It's just nice and clean and smooth. <clears throat> all new glass all the way around. Tinted glass uh, back and the sides. And everything's new. The wiper arms, this trim, the antenna, the mirrors, the handles, the locks. They also use stainless steel hardware everywhere. Every nut and bolt I see, no matter where it is, looks like it's stainless steel. Uh, step side bed, obviously. Back here, got the new chains, LED taillights. Uh, this bumper is real nice. It has a couple marks on it. The quality of the chrome just isn't as good as the front, but it's still a real nice bumper. Nothing wrong with it. Inside the truck is real nice. It's all, it's genuine leather. Even these door panels are glove soft leather and it does match the uh, seats. They're bucket seats, real comfortable. They got the bolsters. Uh, custom made fiberglass center console. It's got plenty of storage space, cup holders, there's actually a TV screen. I haven't figured out how to use it yet. I haven't played with it, but there's a TV screen and a stereo. Got some nice plush carpets in there. 454 motor under the hood. And this is show quality right here. Everything's gloss, silver. If it's metal and everything else is polished chrome and stainless. But the firewall has been cleaned up. It's been made smooth, and they notched it out to fit the motor real nicely. And everything's painted gloss silver. The motor is a 454. It's got ceramic coated long tube headers, a highly polished intake. It's a polished, looks like a Holly four barrel, a dual feed carb with electric choke. It's got a billet distributor with HEI ignition system. 
has polished uh, sill plates, scuff plates, uh, speakers in the council and in the kick panels, custom made kick panels. And there's more towards the back of the console. Has new seat belts, has stainless steel hardware uh, for the latches, has new latches. Inside the bed, it looks brand new. Has the oak, uh, refinished oak floors. Again, all stainless hardware, stainless steel strips. There's no dents, no damage. It just looks new inside here. <clears throat> new instrument bezel. They did fit uh, some new gauges. They fit right in the hole there. But everything's new. I love it has a silver deluxe steering wheel. I've never seen one before. It's a tilt column. But the lever's new. The shift indicator's new. The vents, the knobs, uh, billet pedals, uh, fiberglass kick panels with LED lights built into them. Yeah, big giant aluminum radiator, polished overflow bottle, uh, a chrome shroud. It has custom filler panels right here, a matching uh, custom cover over the battery, uh, air condition, polished compressor, uh, polished master cylinder, uh, all stainless steel brackets and hardware. Has these uh, new custom uh, clamps. They actually shrink. Uh, you heat them up and they shrink on here instead of hose clamps. That's the latest thing. And how the air conditioning hoses, everything's run just so nicely. So I think I'm going to hop in there and start it up for you. I just love this truck. It's gorgeous. Classy. It has custom headlights, it has LED tail lights. It has vintage air. So it has the newer uh, controls inside here. 3,436 miles, so about 3,500 miles since it's been completely built. It's everything about it. I love it. Visit volocars.com. Plenty of ways on there to contact the salesman. I just gave you my honest impression of this truck. If you have any specific concerns or questions, feel free to ask them. That's at volocars.com. Uh, if you enjoy watching the videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon. You'll be the first to see the next ones that are posted. Thanks for watching.